Evangelism, sharing the good news about Jesus Christ, is a natural outpouring of what God is doing in our lives. The more we grow in being disciples and develop a vibrant relationship with God, the more that will spill over into how we live and what we say to others. When we are excited about something, we can't help but share it with others. So this year, the Evangelism Committee would like to focus on our journey as individuals and as a congregation to grow a vibrant relationship with God. We ask the Lord to fill us and keep filling us so that we have extra to pour out into the lives of those around us. We are going to borrow the youth's vision to help us do that. Connect with God. Connect with people. Connect with the world. We connect with God as we worship, pray, and study the Bible. This month we are focusing on worship. Worship is praise, honor, and respect given to God. We come here to proclaim who God is and all that he has done. If someone asked you to present an award, you'd say, okay, who is getting the award and why? The same is true when we worship. God is getting the award. Every scripture, every song, every prayer, every action declares why God deserves this award. As we see and are reminded of who God is, it raises God up and keeps our attitude humble. We cannot pass on what we do not have, and this is where it starts, a relationship with God, in acknowledging who God is and that we need him. Jesus promises us in Matthew 18, 20, For where two or more are gathered in my name, there am I with them. Jesus meets us here in worship. If you want to introduce someone to Jesus Christ, there is no better place for that experience to occur than in worship. Jesus is here, so let's bring others to Jesus by bringing them to worship. Now this doesn't work very well if we come to worship out of guilt, duty, or someone else's expectations. Hey, I gotta go to church on Sunday. Do you want to come and endure it with me? Instead, our joy and anticipation should overflow in our invitation. Wow, I can't wait for worship on Sunday. Do you want to come with me and praise him? And see what he's going to do this week. Have you come this morning in joyful anticipation of meeting God here? Who will you invite to come meet Jesus?